Hello, this is Industrial Surplus. Today we're videotaping a gorgeous, rebuilt, reconditioned Cincinnati three-axis CNC combination horizontal vertical milling machine. It's a model 750-20 VersaPower retrofitted by the Boeing Aerospace Corporation in 1998 in Seattle, Washington. It's equipped with extra length table and the outboard uh, table riggers for supporting the table as it travels across. The table size on this machine is 20 by 117 inches. Longitudinal table travel is 72 inches. The uh, cross saddle feed is 18 inches. Vertical head uh, travel is 24 inches. The maximum distance from the spindle center on the horizontal spindle to the tabletop is 26 inches. And the distance from the spindle nose on the vertical head to the tabletop, maximum distance is 31 inches. They're both equipped with 50 tapered spindle mounts. Uh, this machine is equipped with an Allen Bradley uh, Series 9 CNC control. It's in very good working condition. It's a really well done retrofit. We have a uh, full complement of support manuals, documentation, everything uh, for the machine that was done to it, including uh, uh, all the uh, uh, parts that were made for the machine, the schematics, uh, everything, everything you might need. It's uh, underneath this uh, yellow hood here is a 50 horsepower AC variable speed spindle motor uh, driven by Indramat uh, spindle drives. This is a what they call a dependent spindle, vertical spindle on a overarm. And what that means is that uh, the spindle is dependent on the horizontal spindle to operate. So it has to be in a certain position and uh, to engage the, uh, the feed drive for it. It doesn't have its own motor and it needs to drive off the uh, horizontal spindle. Uh, the outriggers I told you about, it has a uh, retrofitted and update uh, uh, automatic loop system. They did the ball screws on this machine. It's equipped with hard ways, big box column hard ways. You can see the vertical there. Here's some of the horizontals here. Just a solid, rugged, well-built machine that's been updated with all new electronics uh, back in 98. Here's the back side of the machine. The Z-axis uh, feed motor, lubrication system. First class job, I can't uh, stress that enough. Uh, here are the Indramat drives, some of the other electronic components. Over here is the Allen Bradley uh, computer uh, and drives. Relays, PLC, transformers. Very clean, very nice well maintained. Here's uh, the nomenclature tag that they put on there after they do their rebuild. So we're going to, uh, oh here's the uh, coolant pump built into the base. Uh, all the coolant gets uh, back, put back into the base and recirculated through this pump. Uh, you could just see some of the other parts of it. Here's the uh, x-axis drive motor, the table. The table's in perfect condition. They had some kind of fixture on the table. We took that off. Uh, it doesn't look like there's uh, really any marks at all on the machine. All right, we will go ahead and uh, do a little program that was in the machine and do a demonstration of it operating.
We're, uh, we have both spindles turned on for the demonstration. You could either use one or the, we have a plug that goes into the horizontal spindle if you don't need the horizontal spindle and you just want to run with the uh, vertical. I told you it's a 50 horsepower motor, AC variable speed, uh, just, it just sings. and do that again We're kind of up close so I'll uh, stand back a little bit and we could watch it do it again Okay, and uh, maybe we could uh, just kind of show it uh, jogging back and forth uh, end to end a little bit. speed range and within that range you could uh, vary it down to the uh, potentiometer on the control panel massive amount of power Slowest speed range, 1400 is the fastest. And uh, that spindle would be unstoppable at that speed. So uh, why don't we just jog the table a little bit and uh, we'll run it back and forth and uh, show you that. I'm gonna do it with the pulse generator. Okay.
uh, yellow cover on the inch needs to be adjusted. Is that as low as it goes? Uh, as far as height. Okay. All right. Uh, that's the machine. We hope that uh, you're as impressed as we are. And if not, I'm sure you will be when you see it in person. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us. Thank you.